the one, the only, Ben Cio. Good morning, welcome to Yeshiva YouTube Table Enabled. Today we continue with Shulchan Aruch Yom. We finish another week, Simon Reish Nun, 250. <clears throat> I like to say we're about one seventh of the way done with Shulchan Aruch Yom. I believe I, when I counted, there was around 1,750 Simonim. Uh, more a little you know give or take so uh, 250 is pretty monumental let's start preparing food for Shabbos you should wake up very early on Friday to prepare for Shabbos so even if you have a house full of butlers you should prepare one thing for Shabbos at least even though he's a big rabbi and he was probably very busy and he had to, you know, give advice to people and paskin shilas and be a dayan. Nonetheless, he found time to cut the vegetables very thin. He made a salad. They would cut the firewood. He would write, he would light the furnace. He would turn on the heat. Rav Nachman, he was talking to Bayez, and Machnas Kalim, and Srikhim, the Shabbos, and Fana Kleachol. He would take in the Shabbos Kalim and put the the weekday Kalim in storage. And Mahem Yilmud Kaladam, from these people, everyone should learn. Velo Yomar, lo Efkom Mekvodi. I shouldn't, right, ruin my honor. Ki Zeu Chvodo Shemachavi the Shabbos. It's honor to you that you're Machavi the Shabbos. Hagav Yishla Hashkes Asakin Ver Shabbos. You should also sharpen your knife, your bread knife, I guess. Ki Zeu. He's preparing himself to eat better. You cut the chal a little quicker, you get your chal a little quicker. You should have a lot of meat and wine and special treats. If you're richer, you have more. If you're poor, you have less. Um, these are halachas that are relevant to Kavu Shabbos, to Onig Shabbos. And that's the conclusion of today's year. I want to focus in Ian and Tolina on um, the source of this is basically Gomorrah. It's in two places, in Masechah Shabbos and Masechah Kedushin. And we learn, right, that the idea of the Gomorrah here is mitzvah bo yosem shlucho. It's better to do a mitzvah by yourself than with your shliach. You, you have butlers, you have people in your house that will do, prepare Shabbos for you. So to do a shliach, you could do that, but at least something you should do for yourself because mitzvah the mitzvah of Kavu Shabbos is better by yourself than with a shliach. Now, does that apply by all mitzvahs? It, seemingly, the post can say it applies by all mitzvahs. I'd like to suggest not necessarily. There's a reason the two examples in mitzvah Yosef and Shlucho is a Masech's Kedush in the beginning of the second paragraph. Here at Hilcho Shabbos, and also when it comes to marrying a woman, I'll talk more about that. Ion to lean on coming up next.